Gala Games continues to see higher prices after bouncing on a significant key area of support above the 0.01574 in a move that is now holding above the 20-day MA here on the one-hour chart. And the next key area of resistance that we need to see a break above lies above the 0.015, the 0.01846. And on today's video, I will be discussing my breakout target areas and also an additive structure that is playing out here on this chart. And for those of you that might be interested in trading Gala games, you can check out Bing X, where you can claim up to 5,000 USDT in rewards and also claim up to that USDT in sign up bonuses. And I will be leaving a link down in the description box. Getting back to the charts, you can see that after our massive breakdown move on the 5th of August, we saw our lows being made below the 0.01358 and afterwards we started a very nice bounce to the upside where we first picked in this negative count one and after we picked in a negative count one i said to you that i was expecting a bit of a pullback in this negative count two whose minimum target areas i came up with by connecting the fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that negative count one giving me a minimum pullback target area between the FIB level 0.5 and the FIB level 0.618, which perfectly lies between the 0.01558 and the 0.01511, which is the area over here. And this is an area that we didn't quite fully maximize, though we saw a reaction to the area between the FIB level 0.382 and the FIB level 0.5. And there are high chances that we now have a low in place for the second wave between this area on the Fibonacci and whatever we are seeing at the moment could be the start of an impulsive wave to the upside in a larger area to count three which is over here and its minimum target areas can be given by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that area to count one then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave giving me a minimum target area for the third wave at the FIB level 1.618 which perfectly lies above the 0.02231 and once we have a high in this ADOT wave count 3 we can expect a pullback in an ADOT wave count 4 then continue gearing up even higher in that ADOT wave count 5 and for us to see a high in that ADOT wave count 3 we first need to see a break above a significant key area of resistance and that key area of resistance perfectly lies above the 0.01846 and the moment we manage to break above that maybe with a retest then we can continue expecting even higher prices to give us a high in this ADOT wave count 3 so that is what I'm expecting here on the short term and in case of any sudden pullbacks then Gala Games needs to continue holding above the significant key area of support above the 0.01574 because if by any chance we lose this then we can expect another breakdown move back to the significant lows that we made on the 5th of July below the 0.014 dollars and jumping to the daily chart to give you my long term price prediction analysis still basing it on the edit of structures here on the daily chart you can see that after we saw our bear market lows last year we saw an aggressive bounce to the upside giving us a high above the 0 0.08702 in what i'm terming as this edit of count one then we started a breakdown move in a larger edit of count two whose minimum target areas highlighted on the charts using this blue target area we have fully maximized and if I use the Fibonacci here, connecting them from the bear market lows to that high, you can see at some point we lost the FIB level 0 0.88. And that increased the likelihood that Gala Games can easily give us a bear market, a reset of the bear market lows. So that is something that we need to have in mind and cautious about. In case we see any sudden pullbacks, there are high chances that we can easily see a reset of the bear market laws. Then maybe from there we can start, we can have a different edit wave structure here on the charts. So that is the price action that I'm expecting on the short term and also on the long term on the Gala Games chart. And that's all for this video and I hope to catch you on the next one.